Hello everyone, welcome to a new Flux exploration in ComfyUI. So there is a new line art control net that have been issued recently which is the Misto line, we are going to explore it together, from installation to uses phases. Firstly, there is a thorough brief about the whole model within their hugging face page, which you can read if you wish so. The key thing that the mention here is that the model can be only used for research or educational purposes. Another important element is that they mentioned the control net support for GGUF-based quantized flux models. So let's go and download the bin file here. We placed it under a new file we name as the misto underscore model, this file will go under the models folder. We now copy the git URL from their GitHub page. We go to the custom nodes folder and cmd, type git clone and paste the URL. This now should download the necessary nodes within ComfyUI. So now we are going to experiment with this control net, I placed an input image of a modern style architecture. As you can see, I am using the GGUF Unnet model of Flux, as well as GGUF version of the clip loader node, this is a quantized version of Flux that can be used for running Flux for lower systems, which also fastens the queue time. I am using a normal clip text and code since the custom sampler of Themisto already introduced it. As you can see, this one was just for a 512 by 512 resolution. Let's try now play with the guidance and steps amount to test different result and compare them. This was a result of a 4.0 guidance rate, as well as a 15 steps count. This one has a guidance of 4.5, although it seems more colorful, it took more time to finish compared with the 4.0 guidance rate. Finally, I might say that a guidance of 4.0 suites most considering the sampling time as well, the quality will surely increase when increasing the steps count but also it increases the sampling time. I hope you this experiment helped you, and thank you for watching.